Be careful guys, the price is very expensive here. Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel, it's Nawe. In this video, I want to talk about what you should bring when you come to Turkey, either from Myanmar or from anywhere else in the world. So the first thing is obviously food. Everyone loves food. And if you like to cook, it is better to bring the ingredients, the special spices and the ingredient from your own country so especially here in turkey they have a lot of spices but it is uh, difficult to find it since you don't know what is it called in turkish so if you have already ready-made uh, the spices such as if from pakistan or india or in malaysia so you can bring like biryani masala or any different type of masala you know this is, these are the special uh, especially coming from your own country so you should bring all of them uh, especially if you are coming from southeast asia you will not be able to find the cooking ingredient or snack or the ready-made ingredient in turkey even if you find it uh, there are some of the product which um, which is important from indonesia you can find them but it's not that easy and it is also uh, expensive since they are important products and one more thing if you are asia and if you like rice too much you should bring rice cooker here you can find rice cooker but it is so expensive it's not common that people are using rice cooker here. People here, they when they cook rice, they just cook with you know saucepan or small pot, and they cook it on the stove. If you are coming from Asia, Southeast Asia or Asia, we usually cook in a, a rice cooker, and it is very very easy. So, so you should bring your own rice cooker, please. The second thing you should bring is a health and care product so such as um, you know if you have allergy or if you need medicine for your health anything uh, which is serious you should bring it from your own country because you need prescription doctor prescription to buy medicine here so but if such as uh, panadol paracetamol uh, such kind of flu medicine you can easily buy that but if you ha need to buy an antibiotic medicine you need a doctor prescription to buy them and the third thing is the uh, clothing here so uh, here in turkey th uh, the weather in winter is very cold and the summer is very hot here so if you're coming in winter you should bring your own jacket and the winter boot and because uh, when it is snow you need your winter boot you can also buy from here but uh, once you come here uh, in in the beginning you you will not be adjust uh, here so it is better to have a few couple of clothes here first also sometimes it's rain so but don't worry you can find umbrella here you can buy it here so you don't need to bring your own umbrella one more thing is uh, if you're coming in winter season such uh, from october september october until february it is the winter season in turkey so if you're coming in that time uh, you should wear we should wear your jacket on plane first time when i came i i didn't know it was that cold i i came in february and it was too cold in istanbul that when i when i reached the plane arrived that time there is no indoor tube for passenger passing there was no that such thing and there is only leather leather you are in open air and I was, it was so freezing cold and windy too much. So wear your own jacket when you come in winter. The final thing you should bring is the electronic devices. If you need to, if you need to use laptop, you should buy or you should bring your own laptop from your country because the electronic devices here are so much expensive. Because of the tax, the electronic devices become so expensive here. So you should bring your own laptop. If you are using a uh, tablet, you should bring your tablet. And But for mobile telephone, for the mobile, you don't need to bring it. You can bring it, but you need to register it here. So they don't allow you to use your mobile 
which you bring from the outside they will get the service in four months 120 120 days within 120 days you will have to register it so i will talk about how to do the form registration in my next video so stay tuned so if you don't want to waste your money for the form registration you can just simply buy it here but still it is expensive but if you are registering if you are going to register you have to pay 2000 tele registration fees if your phone is not that quite good anymore you don't need to bring it you can just find a new one here but be careful guys the price is very expensive here so you can check the price of the electronic device in the online shopping mall so i will link the online shopping website in the description down below and you can compare how much it will be cost if you want to buy the product here so this is pretty much everything which you need to bring when you come to Turkey. Hopefully this video is helpful for you. If you like the, this video, please give a like and subscribe for the more upcoming video. And let me know what you guys think and uh, what you should bring from your own country based on different country. And if you have more specific questions, also you can write down in the comment section down below. I try to answer as much as possible. In my next video, I will talk about what you should do when you first arrive to Turkey. So thank you very much for watching. I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.